got involved in step count challenge through my workplace um, uh, at North Ayrshire Council. Uh, active travel team organizes those challenges for all the members. We won for the council, so my team won. Uh, I'm saying my team because my uh, my team members nominated me for a captain. Um, so that's another thing that motivated me to do well. I just wanted to lead uh, by example and just do well so so they could kind of be motivated by that and and try hardest as well. It's quite hard during lockdown. You're restricted to certain area or distance you can do. You can walk around. So after a while, the walks become a bit boring, uh, a bit uh, monotonous. Um, so I've tried to make it more attractive by, for example, encouraging my team members to find a new route um, or um, taking a picture of local heritage, for example, one day. Or the other day, I would ask them to take the pictures of spring flowers because it was springtime at that time. They never told me they nominated me, actually. Louise never mentioned anything. I only found out when I won. <laughs> so that was a huge surprise. Um, I mean, it was a great... Um, it, it was great to see that we won for the council, for the for the workplace. So that was amazing achievement during the lockdown. It was it was great and it felt great and I was proud of my team. The biggest benefit uh, of walking during lockdown was for me personally reconnecting with my teenage daughter. Um, it's very difficult to to do that uh, in current um, lifestyle when they constantly uh, stuck to the computer screens and that gave us opportunity to talk again and reconnect and find that relationship, rediscover that relationship again. For me, that was the biggest benefit. I think it will be something that we carry forward because um, I've noticed that she enjoyed it too. Uh, she shared things that she wouldn't normally have a chance or time to share um, and she found the benefit of that. Um, so I think we will carry on.